हेलो दोस्तों आप लोग सोच रहे होंगे मैं हिंदी में क्यों बात कर रहा हूँ तो दोस्तों मैं एक नया चैनल स्टार्ट किया हूँ जो कि ब्लॉग चैनल जिसमें मैं हिंदी में ब्लॉग्स डालूंगा तो दोस्तों डिस्क्रिप्शन में आपको लिंक मिल जाएगा उसको जाइए उसको सब्सक्राइब कीजिए वीडियो को भी पॉज कीजिए जाइए उसको सब्सक्राइब कीजिए और मैंने उसमें एक नया वीडियो भी डाला है उसे देखिए और बताइए आपको कैसा लगा तो चलिए इस वीडियो को स्टार्ट करते बिना और समय गवाए वट्स अप गाइज मैंने सपनी श्रीवास तो एंड वेलकम बैक टू द चैनल सो गैस फ्यू डेज एगो आई मेड अ वीड ऑन हाउ टू इंस्टॉल एंड रन दी डॉट एक्स सी फर्स्ट ऑन स्मार्टफोन यूजिंग द बॉक्स सिक्सटी फोर ड्राइड एंड द डेवलपर ऑफ द बॉक्स सिक्सटी फोर ड्राइड एड रिसेंटली अपडेटेड डी बॉक्स सिक्सटी फोर ड्राइड रिपोजिटरी ऑफ गेट ऑफ एंड डे गिव एन न्यू अपडेट फॉर दिस सो द वीडियो डेट आई मेड अर्लियर वॉज नाउ गेटिंग ओल्ड एंड नाउ द न्यू मेटेड हैज टू बी सोन टू यू लाइक हाउ टू इंस्टॉल द लेटेस्ट वर्जन ऑफ द बॉक्स सिक्सटी फोर ड्राइड ऑन स्मार्टफोन सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल गाइज बॉक्स सिक्सटी फोर ड्राइड इज स्टिल इन डेवलपमेंट सो मे फाइंड सम बर्ग्स और सम प्रॉब्लम्स टू डोंट वरी जस्ट गो एंड ज्वाइन द टेलीग्राम चैनल एंड जस्ट कमेंट इट एंड जस्ट मैसेज देयर दे विल ट्राई टू हेल्प फॉर ऑल ऑफ योर प्रॉब्लम ओके एंड ऑल्सो कीप अपडेटिंग द बॉक्स सिक्सटी फोर ड्राइड using the github so in today's video it's all about like how to install the latest version of box 64 droid on your smartphone even the box 64 droid let you run the high end pc games like gta 5 or call of duty or assassin's creed so just make sure to click on the subscribe button and press the bell icon so in the future i'm going to make different gameplay videos of all these games so just make sure to click on the subscribe button and press the bell icon so you'll never miss any kind of this video okay so let's start the video but i was taking any more time So here you can see guys we are on a smartphone. So first of all you have to go to the description or the comment section will find this pin comment where you will find a link to this data profile. Just go and open it. So it will open something like this. Here you have to just read out everything like what is the latest update given by the Box 64 Droid developer and below you will find the link to download the Termax app. Click on the Termax and later on you also have to install and download the Termax X11. So for that what you have to do you have to click on Termax X11. and along with that you will also find a link to download the input bridge app which will help you to give the controls to run the games so it will take some time to download again so the next thing you have to do you have to copy the command that is given below that is curl minus o now here you have to copy this command so let me move termex app and termex x11 to my home screen so after installing both of them just open a termex app click on allow Now paste the command here and hit enter. Select the non-root version. If your smartphone is rooted, you can select the root version. And for virtual, if your smartphone have MediaTek processor, then select the third option. So it's going to take some time. Here it will ask for permission to access the internal storage. so give here allow now it will take some time to install and download all the required packages it will ask for y n n give y every time and hit enter so it will ask multiple times so just give y every time So what you have to do, you have to type her command. So before that, just let me tell you that Box64 Droid developer has changed the default command that I used earlier in the older video. So just type here Box64 Droid space hyphen hyphen start. So earlier the command to start the Box64 Droid was different. Now is it is different? Okay. So it will take some time to open here. Now here select the first option, which is Box64. and hit enter now select the first option here again that is 800 by 600 now go back to your home screen and click and hold on it box x11 click on the preferences go to display resolution mode select exit now select the resolution to be 800 x 600 now go back to your home screen and here you also have to disable the sort additional keyboard now go back to home screen click on uh, termex x11 and here it will show black screen with this cursor So you have to wait here. It might be possible for you that it will open the desktop, and it might be possible it will stuck here. So to fix this, what you have to do, you have to uh, firstly wait here for uh, around two three minutes, and if still gets uh, like keeps showing this cursor without the desktop. So what you have to do, you have to go back to the your home screen, and from there you have to restart the 
box 64 droid okay so let me do it again so just click on home screen and so type here one hit enter it will stop the wine now just give the again the same command and hit enter now select the first option here hit enter now select the one first option again now open the termix x11 again and now wait here and let it to come and here you can see now cursor is showing so it means now it's loading so if you face this difficulty just uh, restart the box 64 droid now you can see we are on the desktop of the box 64 droid so the first thing that i have to do that i will show you that how to set up the input bridge app so it will input bridge app will give you controls to control the games okay so for that click on input bridge app open it and click on copy installer to root folder it will save the installer to the download folder now what you have to do you have to click on the termx x11 again go to the d drive you will find the input bridge folder here open it go to installer and click on ib.exe and open it you can see input bridge is running now click on ib.exe and click on open so what it will happen it will connect the uh, input bridge and now you can see the controls so first of all let me uh, remove this controls from the screen click on the setting and click on the eye icon now you can see just minimize the terminal here so in the background it will keep running now the one thing you have to make sure that if you want to run any type of dot exe files you have to move it to download folder now click on the start click on the dxvk and click on install dxvk 2.2 so there are multiple version of dxvk okay 2.2 2.1 2.0 and so you can what you can do that uh, if you want to run any game you can just copy it in the download folder here you can see it will be uh, visible in the d drive and if you face any difficulties running that game just change the version from dxvk to uh, 2.2 to 2.1 2.0 so just try different version but the fastest uh, version is it dxvk 2.2 you can see i have the game the assassin's creed gt5 so in the next videos i will show like uh, the gameplay of gt5 and others so that's all guys for this video i hope you like it and this video is all about like how to install the latest version of box 64 drive and the latest update given by the developers of the box 64 drive because the my older videos shown you the different method and now this that method is no no longer is required so you guys need to know right how to install the latest version of the box 64 drive so that's why I made this video. So I hope you like this video. If you face any kind of difficulties, just comment down below. And if you find my Instagram profile link, just go and follow me and message me. I will try to help as much as I can. Okay. So thanks for watching this video. Have a good day. Good luck and bye. Take care.